More than a thousand people from Afghanistan have recently arrived in Ohio seeking safety and new beginnings for their families. And it is never easy to leave behind a life that you know and move halfway around the globe. I think it was a shock for me. But there are ways those in Northeast Ohio are making it easier. Home of Ash shows one man's journey. This might look like heaven to some people. Great Lakes Cheese in Hiram, Ohio, a place where everywhere you look, you find every type of cheese. Sliced, diced, raining down mozzarella. But for some, this place is a new beginning. My name is Waisuddin Habibzai. Wasuddin arrived in the United States from Afghanistan six months ago, fleeing his homeland for his family's safety. He came with his wife, two young daughters, a few thousand dollars in his pocket. Shock and disaster for me, just leaving. We had no other choice except just leaving and abandoning everything behind and leaving everything behind. So he set out to get a job, and despite being educated and experienced in an office setting, Wasadin believed he needed to start all over again, interviewing at first for factory jobs. But we saw the talent and the potential that Wasadin has and said, let's take a chance and see how it goes. Mara Kamet is the VP of Human Resources at Great Lakes Cheese. They provide 25% of the cheese in America and have doubled in size in the last five years. 4,000 employees and growing. So many companies have been downsizing and struggling to hire, and you guys are here doubling, so the pandemic was good for cheese. The pandemic was great for cheese. She says they have made a conscious effort for years to hire refugees, like the many Hmong refugees they brought in years ago to their three Wisconsin facilities. They are very loyal and committed, uh, like many of our other employees as well, and so we've seen the benefit of that. And having a diverse workforce means adapting the workplace. Multicultural spaces, prayer rooms, even donation drives to help refugees get what they need to get their lives in America started. According to the Ohio Department of Jobs and Family Services, our state has welcomed roughly 1,600 Afghan arrivals in recent months, most of them coming straight here to Cleveland. I'd say first and foremost, they're incredibly loyal employees. Evan Schwalik is the Economic Integration Coordinator at Us Together, a refugee resettlement agency. Translation, he helps people find jobs. There's a huge influx of, real, of people who are really eager and, and ready to, to work and give back to the communities that are, that are hosting them. Like Wasadine. Instead of getting the factory job he applied for, Great Lakes Cheese created a position for him in their human resources department to take advantage of his experience and skills. Proof that refugees and immigrants don't need to start from the very beginning when they come to America. Sometimes when there is challenges, when there is difficult times, so there's always opportunity. I try to make best out of the worst. Homa Bash, News 5.